What's going on guys? This is the Lamer Gamer here with some of For Honor Beta. I am so excited to bring this to you guys. I've been following this game for a while. I am a huge fan of hand-to-hand -hand combat. I was in the closed beta before. This is the open beta now. It is go live now. It is available all weekend. I am just going to jump right into it for you here. You've got your 1v1 duels, your 4v4, your 4v4 Dominion battles, and your 2v2 brawls. The Dominion battles are really where it's at, though. Those are the all-out battles that you hear about when you hear about this game. Um, but I am going to be showing you guys all of this in full detail as much as I can uh, throughout the weekend, as long as this is live and as much as I can. So right here I'm going to start it off with a 1v1 battle just to give you guys an idea of what's going on. I've already done a little bit of work with my Viking character, but I, I'm trying to get off my feet with the uh, the Samurai. So this is my first, uh, first attempt at a 1v1 battle with the Samurai, which I think is kind of harder because you really need to really need to focus on what's going on around you and what the opponent is doing. So for those of you who haven't seen anything on this game yet whatsoever, um, the gameplay is really heavily focused, um, well, to focused around three factions, the Vikings, the Samurai, and the Knight uh, classes. Uh, it looks like I'm fighting a Knight here, and uh, the uh, right there you can see uh, the three directions with the right stick. Those are the three uh, three directions you can block and or attack from. Um, as you can see you can, the, on the on the other on the knight there, you can see which direction they're they're uh, facing, which wh which way they're standing. Um, oh, getting wrecked here. Um, and you try and not only block that, but you also want to attack on a side that they're not blocking on. So it really you really have to have a really delicate balance of your your sword handling, and I think that this game does it really well. I, however, did not right there. Um, but it's best out of five, so we're gonna we're gonna get another another couple goes here and see how it goes. But um, like I said, I'm just I'm just learning the samurai character. I was kind of playing him like a Viking there. Let's see if we can get a little more tactical with this. There we go. The stun. Yeah. So the thing with uh, with a samurai that I've been learning is that he with anytime he stuns the enemy, he gets to come into his combo uh, on the second hit rather than the first. Um, and since all the combos in this game are more or less three hits. Um, that's that's really useful, especially because whenever he finishes with an overhead strike like that, it's charged. Um, and see, he's just about dead there, and I got a execution on him there. And the executions aren't easy to do. I actually, I actually took a little bit to figure that out. Um, the way you do the executions, you have to finish off your opponent with a heavy strike. And if one once you finish him off with a heavy strike, you'll see a pretty quick prompt on the bottom to either press square or triangle to do one of two different executions. Um, so we're one for one now. Oh, okay. Yeah, the uh, the executions I think are a really nice touch because when you're in the heat of these you know these larger scale battles and you you pull one of those off, they look really epic. And I'm like I said, I'm a big fan of hand to hand combat. I just think it is so much so much more interesting to see the choreography of that rather than just like looking down the the barrel of a gun sight over and over again like you do in a lot of games nowadays so this is definitely one that I'm going to be picking up the full game of there we go yeah finish it off with the overhead strike and down through the spine beautiful 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 gotta finish the taunt too you can taunt with triangle I'm playing this on the PS4 um, like I said in one of my previous videos, all of my videos are going to be on the PS4 just because it'll be that much easier for me to record. Um, and for anybody who did see my previous video, I'm not abandoning that uh, permadeath arc file. It's still going on, still going strong. Don't you worry, I didn't die yet. But we are now uh, we are now one and two here. So if I win this, I win it because it's three out of five. Looks like it could go either way. I like the mace, though. See, something that I really like about this game as well is that there, there's... Um, yeah, see. Get all talking. But something that I really like about this game is that there is a whole ton of customization. Not just, like, you know, the colors, the emblems, you know, the the mask, the actual armor and outfits that you wear. Um, but the weapons and armor itself actually have perks to them. You know, you different damage uh, resistance or damage dealing if you're on your weapon. 
Um, I actually just unlocked some for the samurai here. I just got some new arm armor. I got a new hilt on my sword. Um, Uh-oh. Okay, focus. It's two and two. Whoever wins this wins it all. Oh, man, this is going to be a tense ending. Oh, man. Okay, okay. Get back, get back, get back. All right, let's see if I can get in there with a little stun. Nice, nice. Okay, okay. Still still evening it out. Oh, man. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Get back. Let's see if I can get the stun move in there one more time. Yes, and the finisher. Yeah, all right. So that is how you win a 1v1 duel. Well, actually, hopefully you win it a little, a little less, with a little less nail biting than I just did. But you know, it shows you know it shows your stats at the ends. But more importantly, it shows you know it says scavenging the battlefield, which I think is so cool. And look, oh yeah, got a got a new mask out of that. So we'll see what that does in just a second. You get a little experience. And you can level up your character, and new parts come unlocked as you unlock your character and whatnot. You can see that does. A little bit a little bit of resistance there but thanks you guys for watching more videos to come stay tuned if you're interested in for honor these are going to be exclusive for the rest of the weekend as long as i am allowed to lamer gamer signing off